charge is three dollars in the U.S. Although it here it's way less expensive than that. It's very inexpensive here. Uh, if you happen to be with IPL, it's seventy-five cents to charge the car at night. Um, Duke Energy, it's around two dollars, which is still below the national average. So you're basically paying about one to two cents per mile to drive the car in this area. And then the battery pack will last you between 120 and 150 thousand miles. Over time, what will happen is it'll gradually lose some capacity, just like any other battery. So when you hit 120,000 miles, the battery should still hold 70 to 80 percent of its initial capacity. Meaning, instead of getting 100 miles of range on a charge, you'll get 70 to 80 at that point. And then that's when it'll probably be time to start to consider some battery replacement options. The price of replacing the battery is the only thing today that I don't really have an answer for, just because it's so far in the future hopefully more than 10 years before you would have to consider replacing any of these. So in 10 years, hopefully these batteries will be much, much less expensive than what it would cost if we were to do it today. Right here, just so you guys can see this, 